now the business has uh, you know analyzed that it has invested a lot of amount of money in the inventory and it wants to work on that inventory part so that uh, you know we do not end up uh, having a lot of money being invested in the inventory so basically we need to find out that uh, which is the uh, major category or sub category where there is a lot of inventory and a lot of money got stuck in the inventory how to do that so first of all we need to find out the cost of all the products that is very very important because we do not know the cost we will not be able to find out how much money is invested where so we have revenues we have profit now we have to use a major to calculate the cost right so there are multiple options available so here we would be using uh, the calculated column cost right so go to the table orders and add a new column cost is equal to sales minus profit and we got this cost for each and every row this is the cost we have right so this is the column calculated column go back here now we want need to see the products or the sub categories with the highest cost sub categories and we will take cost increase the size a bit so these are the sub categories with their cost but we do not we are not supposed to look at the cost we need to find out the maximum cost in this particular sub category what will we do instead of cost we will take maximum of cost so basically in the accessory sub categories there is one product whose highest cost is 2711 so this is which we can control to control the amount being invested in the inventory like in the appliances sub category there is a product with the cost 1890 so there we can reduce the inventory and we can save on the amount being invested in the inventory this is how we need to approach because it is not possible to pull all the amount from the inventory we have to have some of the inventories but in in case we are facing the situation that are a lot of money got stuck in the inventory then we will target the product with the maximum cost price and then we will try to reduce the inventory for them so that we can get the control over the cost so this is how we need to approach so what we did here we used a calculated column instead of calculated column we can use the major also that will also work but uh, both of the options you can try so i uh, decided to go with the calculated column of cost we did that and after that instead of using the max function i have used this capability in power bi to use maximum from here itself so no need to go for any extra major when we have this as inbuilt capability here in case we need something else apart from some average minimum maximum and these options then yes we have no options left but we have to go with major but in this case we could just manage the entire scenario with calculated column and this regular capability we have here 